Hello, hello, Virgo, and welcome into Speak Life. My name is Mia. Today, we're going to see what messages come through for the dark truth. <clears throat> Please, universal energies, spirit guides, ancestors, please bring forward two more messages for Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Please, universal energies, spirit guides, ancestors, please bring forward one more message for Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Please, universal energies. Virgo, you open up the reading with the Knight of Wands. Okay, this is someone who is coming in really fast, always ready to go, always like Speedy Gonzalez, yet, listen, still taking forever, okay? Um, not stable enough. The Knights are very in and out energy, very flighty, very impulsive, immature, reckless, not the place to be. Why? Because, listen, they always come in really fast, but notice that they're coming in on a bug, okay? Because they're not stable. They're actually part of the bug. Okay, um, you also have here three of pentacles in the past, okay? More than two people in this equation, somebody that you could have met at work. Maybe for some of you, there's a recent situation in your life where you were working with three people at your workplace, you know? Uh, you also have here the Four of Cups. Some of you are nursing your empty cups, okay? Some of you are throwing away the opportunity to push yourself through the threshold. Why? Because, listen, your, your, your energy is coming across as immature, okay? Take it as it fits. If you were involved with somebody and this person you met through work, it is time to stop nursing the three empty cups, okay? Why is the Knight of Wands here? Please, universal energies, spirit guides, ancestors, please bring forward the Knight of Wands. Listen, this may be you wanting to give a speedy offer of passion to somebody. Listen, I'm going to tell you right now, if you are running after someone, you need to stop, okay? There is an end to a situation. Either you left, somebody left an equation, okay? You left an equation. Listen, this was a temptation. This was a demonic energy. This was this 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 was the devil, okay? The devil came knocking at your door and you opened up. Keep in mind the energies can be reversed. This is not a personal reading. So please save yourselves the comments, okay? Um, but some of you know that the relationship had to come to an end. Why? Because, it, listen, this was demonic. It was here to show you something, to show you a lesson, okay? It came to a brutal end. You just couldn't take it anymore. They left. You left. Why is the three of pentacles here? Three of pentacles. Three of Pentacles, the High Priestess, High Priestess, Sun, and the Tower, OMG, okay, the High Priestess, okay, you knew, you were following your intuition, okay, you knew that there were secrets, you knew the things that you were getting involved with. You just chose not to speak about it. Okay, you also have here the sun. Things are going to get better. For those of you that have reached rock bottom in a certain situation, because let me tell you something, that this is hitting rock bottom. Okay, this is having a, a, a meltdown, basically. Okay, <laughs> you know, okay. Um, you also have here. The tower. 
something came crashing down, something that you built on a faulty foundation, something that was built on lies and deceptions, okay? It wasn't meant to last. It wasn't meant to test, to, to last the test of time. Why? Because it was karmic. It was only put in front of you as a temptation and you opened up the door, okay? Because on the other side was this person, this demonic energy who ruins your life, who has the potential to continue to ruin your life. Why is the tower here? Please, universal energies, spirit guides, ancestors, why is the tower here? Ooh, okay. Hold up. Six of Wands. Nine of Pentacles. And Three of Cups. Somebody left. The person who left this situation in the past, listen, they left victoriously. They left without thinking any about anything. They didn't care. Okay, the tower fell on the floor. I'm not even going to go get it. Six of cups, okay, thinking about the past for some of you. Um, this could have been a karmic soulmate, okay? Picking it up as could have been a karmic soulmate, okay? Somebody that came in. Okay, to teach you something um, with the Six of Cups, I also feel that, like I said, a past life soulmate, and this was a karmic past life soulmate. Um, nine of Pentacles, okay, looking for your independence. This person could have been looking for their independence, okay, enjoying the fruits of your labor. Okay, if you're at, with, if you're at the Nine of Pentacles, I just feel that for some of you, you have basically... Um, what was I going to say? Oh, geez. I pulled this card out. Um, if you're at the Nine of Pentacles, that means that you have worked extremely hard to where you are and you are finally ready to enjoy some of the fruits of your labor. However, listen, you have a demonic energy that is still haunting your brain. Okay. You have here um, with the four of you have here with the Four of Cups, you have here the Ace of Swords. Some clarity coming through for some of you, the truth coming through, um, either you being honest with someone, someone being honest with you. However, listen, you are not, you are going to have a missed opportunity if you do not open up your eyes because you are still nursing some cups and listen they're empty i don't even know why you're doing that to yourself they're empty why is it three i mean the four of cups here one more time somebody here gave themselves their own walking papers okay Somebody here decided to leave an equation. Listen, I hope that this is you. I hope that you look at it as they had a missed opportunity with you and you're finally seeing clear of that. And, you know, I hope that you can actually find yourself some way to the end of the tunnel, even though I don't see the hermit here. But, you know, this was temptationist behavior, you know, and and some of you fell into this equation without really giving it too much thought. Listen, the demonic energy will ruin your life if you let it, okay? Like I said, somebody that you potentially met through work relations at work. Hang woman. Listen, somebody here is upside down while somebody victoriously walked away, okay? You take the part that fits you the best because apparently I am still seeing that although there was a fucking ending here that came to a total blast, you know, with especially with the tower because I have it on the floor, which I'm not going to pick up. Um, I can't help but feel that somebody here is still holding on to this demonic energy, knowing full well that somebody here left a situation. Thank you so much for being here, Virgo, and enjoy your day.